what I do right now is I'm a one-on-one -on -one aide. I'm doing that as I finish my education. So eventually I want to be a teacher, but if I had any wish granted right now, it would be to be an elementary school principal. That's the main goal. What do you do in your free time? You know, I love to play music. Whenever I'm not doing homework or when I'm not working, I like to play music. I grab my guitar, I jam out for like 20 minutes and then I have to go back to work. Sometimes I play indie alternative, something like loosely with bizarre key signatures, but I love playing classic rock. That's my go-to. I would love to tell you what makes me tick. The, my, the students that I work with, I, they're awesome people. And you know, just to see them do their absolute best in the classroom makes me very happy. Just to see a, a student actually get a math problem or get something right, or just even tell a funny joke to me and have that kind of relationship with the student where they can just come up to you, they'll let you know what they, you know, what's going on with them, what's making them tick. And I think it's cool to be a part of that. And I wouldn't trade that time for anything in the world. Can you list some of your favorite things in life? I love listening to music. I also like hanging out with my friends, playing video games. That's one thing that I really miss uh, with the ki kind of crazy schedule that I have now. But um, I like just spending time with people that want to spend time with me. I understand you have a YouTube channel. What's it about? I have two friends. They're great guys. They're twins. We have our YouTube channel called Blue Toast Gaming. I love to play video games. And technically, our YouTube channel is catered to that. We do strategy guides, mostly on The Legend of Zelda, because that's our all-time favorite game. And we kind of have this element, because we know that there's a lot of YouTube that are inappropriate for kids. So we try to make a YouTube channel PG catered to the kids. So I remember you said that you had multiple jobs. Uh, can you tell me some more about those? Yes. So I work at Manteca Unified School District, and that's Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And on Fridays, after work, from Manteca Unified School District, I do give every child a chance. So, since you like to teach kids and you like music, have you ever taught anyone music? Actually, that's a good question. Uh, I have volunteered for uh, GK Music, and I've done some lessons with the kids that are learning. So Christopher, what's a typical day like for you at work? Typical day is where I hang out with the students, I associate with them, pretty much oversee what they're doing. I don't want to be up in their face most times, but usually it's just to keep an eye and to guide them in the right direction. So you said that you are still attending school, right? Yes. Where are you going to school? Right now I'm going to CSU Stanislaus, right in Turlock. What grade are you in? <laughs> I'm actually a super senior, so this is actually my last term. I'm taking 20 units right now. Very stressful. What major do you have and what is your goal with this education? Right now, I'm, my major is liberal studies and I have a concentration in English. My goal for this entire degree is just to get into a classroom. I've been in and out of classrooms as a teacher's aide, so I'm just ready for my own. <laughs> Christopher, if you were to ask an uh, interesting question about yourself, what would you ask? I'd ask, why do you do all this? <laughs> why do you put yourself through it? I know why I'm doing all this stuff. Um, I just have a huge passion for what I do at work, and I want to make a difference. Do you have anyone else that pushes you to do what you do? I would have to say my friends. My friends right now, they're teachers, they're doing it, you know, they just got jobs this last summer and I'm kind of in school and I, although it, that can be discouraging, I just use it as a motivator. Like, hey, I'm almost there, I'm gonna do it too. I just gotta keep on keeping on.